armed with a cannon, missiles, and machine guns. Tanks are the ultimate weapon and dominate in the battlefield. They remove man from the limitations of his frail flesh and wrap him in several inches of solid steel and high-tech ceramics, turning him into a modern Roman god of war, dispensing death and destruction to his enemies. Hello and welcome to another episode of the Infographic Show. Today we're taking a look at 50 incredible facts about tanks. 50. Tanks first saw duty in September 1916, during World War I at the Battle of the Somme. Envisioned as a way of breaking the gridlock of trench warfare, most of these primitive tanks quickly broke down, and their ultimate effect on the enemy was more psychological than kinetic. 49. Tanks got their name from the British. During their development, the Brits took to calling the massive machine tanks to make any German spies think that they were building massive water tanks to provide water to troops. 48. The very first tank, the Mark I, weighed 26 tons and was armed with 57mm guns. It had a top speed of 3.7 miles per hour. 47. A modern American Abrams M1A2 tank by comparison weighs 68.7 tons and is armed with a 120mm cannon. It has a top speed of 41.5 miles per hour. 46. Tanks were categorized by gender depending on their armament during World War I. Male tanks had cannons and female tanks had machine guns. 45. Despite their terrifying presence on a battlefield, early tanks were not particularly effective. By the end of the fourth day of the Battle of Amiens in 1918, the British Tank Corps, which had consisted of over 500 tanks, was left with only six. 44. Britain and France manufactured a total of 6,506 tanks during World War I, while Germany built only 20 between 1916 and 1918. 43. The smallest tank ever made was the French Renault UE Chenillette, just under 9 feet long and 4 feet tall. 42. The largest tank battle in history was the Battle of Kursk in July 1943. An estimated 23,000 tanks and over 4 million men took part, and at the end of the battle the Germans lost 350 tanks versus 800 by the Russians. 41. The world's most expensive tank is the French Army's AMX-53 Leclerc, with an estimated cost of $12.5 million. 40. With over 22,000 tanks of varying degrees of modernity, Russia commands the largest battle tank force in the world. 39. The United States, with 9,000 tanks, is second to Russia in tank numbers. 38. The Russian military routinely hosts a tank biathlon that tests the crew's ability to provide accurate and rapid fire under a variety of terrain conditions, as well as tests the ruggedness and the durability of the vehicles themselves. 37. In 2015, 17 nations were invited to take part in Russia's tank biathlon, including Angola, Kuwait, Nicaragua, China, India, and Venezuela. Russia won all 13 categories of the tournament, and all nations except China competed using the Russian-built T-72 tank. 36. The Battle of Golan Heights between Israel and Syria is considered the greatest tank battle ever fought in terms of military success. An Israeli defense force of 3,000 troops, 180 tanks, and 60 artillery pieces brought an assault of 28,000 Syrian troops, 800 tanks, and 600 artillery pieces to a dead standstill. 35. Russia's T-54 and T-55 series of tanks are the most widely produced tank models in the world. Debuting in 1943, over 100,000 have been built, and their most recent use came during the Libyan Civil War in 2011. 34. The most technologically advanced tank in the world is widely believed to be the US's M1A2 Abrams, with a host of communications, surveillance, and electronic defense and countermeasures. 33. Russia's T-90 tank is equipped with the largest cannon in the world, at 125 mm. Russia's next-generation T-14 Armada, however, also has a 125 mm cannon, but can be upgraded to a 152 mm cannon in the future for some serious power. 32. The Battle of 73 Easting during the First Gulf War in 1991 is considered the last great tank battle of the 20th century and pitted Iraq's elite Republican Guard forces against the US's 1st, 2nd, and 3rd armored divisions. 31. 
Despite being widely feared for their expertise, even amongst American commanders, the battle was nearly completely one-sided against Iraq's Republican Guard forces, with Iraq suffering up to 1,000 killed and wounded, 1,300 prisoners taken, 160 tanks destroyed, 180 personnel carriers destroyed, 12 artillery pieces destroyed, and 80 wheeled support vehicles destroyed. The US suffered 6 killed in action, 19 wounded, and 1 Bradley Infantry fighting vehicle destroyed. 30. The stunning outcome of the Battle of 73 Easting led to Russian designers rethinking several elements of the T-72's design. As the T-72 had been the tank most in use by Iraqi forces, Russian military leadership concluded after the battle that the only way to stop an American armored advance would be the use of tactical nuclear weapons. 29. Russia's next-generation T-14 tank is possibly the most advanced main battle tank in the world. Unfortunately, its ballooning costs has led Russia to scrapping plans to buy more than 100 of them, and is instead turning to updating older T-72, T-80, and T-90 tanks instead. 28. Poland is experimenting with what it calls the tank of the future. Called the PL-01, the tank is coated with a chameleon-like skin that enables it to mimic the infrared signature of its surroundings, making it much harder to detect with infrared sensors. 27. The US Abrams M1A1 is considered the best all-around tank in the world, with Russia's T-14 directly challenging it for the top spot. However, the undisputed best protected tank in the world is Britain's Challenger 2, with its state-of-the-art composite Chobham armor, a classified secret. 26. During NATO's invasion of Iraq, a British Challenger 2 was struck by 14 RPGs and one anti-tank missile. The crew survived and the tank was back in operation six hours later. 25. Another Challenger was later hit by 70 RPGs and also survived. 24. The only Challenger 2 ever destroyed in combat was a friendly fire incident in 2003. No Challenger 2 has ever been lost to enemy action. 23. The fastest tank in the world is the British FV-101 Scorpion, which can reach speeds over 51 miles per hour. 22. Syrian rebels have developed their own homemade tank, the Sham-2. It's equipped with several inches of steel and iron armor and a turret-mounted machine gun. Five video cameras ring the tank, and a PlayStation controller operates the machine gun. 21. During the Korean War, U.S. soldier Eduardo C. Gomez took out an enemy tank single-handedly by crawling across an open rice field, climbing atop the tank, and prying open the hatch before dropping a grenade inside. Remembering to lock the hatch has been an important element of tank crew training since. 20. During the Battle of Stalingrad, factories in the war-torn city continued to produce tanks unabated. The tanks were unpainted and lacked gun sights, and driven straight from the factory floor to the front line. 19. During World War II, a single Soviet KV-1 tank stalled the advance of an entire German division for a full day. Facing off against an infantry assault, several German tanks, and German anti-tank guns, grenades thrown into the hatches eventually killed the crew inside, which were buried with full military honors after the battle by the Germans. 18. An Australian MK3 Centurion, serial number 169041, was nicknamed the Atomic Tank after surviving a 9.1 kiloton nuclear blast from 460 meters away. The tank was driven off after the test and served for another 23 years. 17. In 1989, as part of a crackdown against pro-democracy protests, Chinese tanks massacred 300 students protesting the communist government. 16. The most famous image of the 1989 Tiananmen Square protests is that of a single man stopping a column of tanks with a raised hand, quickly spread around the world, and is today one of the most iconic images ever captured. Yet, as it is heavily censored in China, most Chinese do not recognize it. 15. A tank designed by the Swiss military once suffered from a bug where turning on the heater might cause the main gun to fire. 14. 
The longest tank-to-tank -tank kill in history occurred when a British Challenger tank destroyed an Iraqi T-62 at a range of 5,100 meters, or over 3 miles. 13. In 2006, Hungarian protesters hotwired a 50-year-old Soviet T-34 tank that was part of an outdoor memorial and drove it against riot police. 12. In the 1980s, the Soviet Union developed a laser tank equipped with artificial ruby-powered lasers. The 1K17 Skatia was meant to destroy enemy optical equipment, but proved too expensive to be practical. 11. During World War II, the US developed a prototype super tank, the T-28 Super Heavy Tank. Weighing in at nearly 100 tons, this monster was meant to break through the German defenses of the Siegfried Line, but was ultimately abandoned. 10. The Brad Pitt World War II film Fury featured an authentic and operational Tiger I tank from World War II, the first time such a vehicle has ever appeared on film. 9. Of 1,300 of Germany's fearsome Tiger I tanks, widely believed to be some of the best made during World War II, only seven remain intact today. 8. As a way to defeat German tanks, the Soviets trained dogs to carry bombs attached to their backs and crawl under enemy tanks before detonating. However, because Soviet tanks were used in the training, when deployed the dogs targeted Russian tanks instead of German tanks. A slight oversight. 7. Arnold Schwarzenegger served as a tank crew member during his mandatory service in the Austrian Armed Forces in 1965. Later, he bought the same tank he served in, an M47, and now uses it to support charitable causes. 6. Drive a Tank, a business in Kasota, Minnesota, is the only place in the United States civilians are allowed to drive a military tank. 5. During World War II, German tanks were coated with a putty-like material known as Zimmerit to prevent magnetic mines from sticking to them. 4. Object 269 was a Soviet tank developed in 1959 that was designed to survive a nuclear explosion. Little did the Soviets know that the Australians had apparently beaten them to the punch. 3. Along with the British Challenger, no American Abrams tank has ever been destroyed in combat by enemy fire. 2. Since World War II, all British tanks are equipped with a device that allows for the heating of water called a boiling vessel. Rumored to have been developed because British soldiers used to have to exit their tank to boil water and make tea, which endangered them and wasted time. 1. The Nazis once planned a truly monstrous tank, named appropriately enough the P-1500 Monster. Weighing 1,500 tons, the tank was too big for road or rail and was designed as a land battleship with a crew of 100 plus. Despite Hitler eagerly okaying the concept, it was eventually scrapped, probably for being absolutely insane. What other tank facts do you know of? What's truly the best tank of all time? Let us know in the comments. Also, be sure to check out our other video, 50 Facts About the Cold War. Thanks for watching, and as always, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.